Hey everybody, what's going on? Jerome here and welcome to GeoGuessr, the fun game where we have to go around and guess where exactly we are in the world based on Google Maps. We can travel forward and back using the actual Google Maps thingy, so I gotta go like that and just take me closer or further away from different areas. Uh, and that's about it. So for the first challenge, I decided to make it a little easier on myself. We just chose America specifically, uh, but then we're gonna do more of a world one and you can test around like different areas and stuff. It actually seems pretty fun. So we're gonna head in and do that. Smash that like button if you guys are enjoying. Follow me on Instagram, link in the description and everything like that, and uh, let's get to it. So, right away, the first inkling I have is that these are maybe, maybe the Rocky or the Sierra Nevada Mountains? Well, I'm gonna stick with my gut. This seems like a pretty strong patch of open road that will never bring us to our destination, really. So, let's, let's go with the... Uh... Let's go with the, the, with the rocky area. Sierra Nevada, maybe. I don't know. Some. Let's. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with Nevada. Like up there in Nevada. Let's see. Oh my! 290. That's really not that bad, actually. That's that was not an awful guess. So I'm, I'm happy with that one. I, I can live with that. All right, this one. I mean, come on. This could literally be anywhere. Like literally anywhere. If I. I had to guess I'm gonna go with with somewhere in the south, but I mean this could literally be anywhere. This this is the middle of nowhere. It's like no way to know where I am. Okay, let's go this way. Stop. No. Is there anything more around here? No, just stop sign still. Wait, what's that say? On the side of the building there. Crest line. I don't recognize the area code either. Oh, so that might be a problem. Wait, are those? Were those? What? Oh, I, th I thought that was like a, like a Civil War cannon. I was like, what? <laughs> why? Why is that there? What are? What is? What does this company specialize in selling exactly? Um. All right. So my inkling is still with the South, but. 910. Why does that area code sound so familiar? It really does sound familiar to me. I, I just can't. South Carolina state line. In a Marlboro County. No way. We just found it on a sign. No way. Alright, we just gotta find where Marlboro County is. I don't know. I don't know where. I mean, this thing doesn't break it up by, by counties. The South Carolina state line, though. Which means it could even be North Carolina. Oh, that's annoying. Well, where exactly actually is the... Okay, so the border's there. Let's go with Augusta. Make the guess. I was within... Ah, oh, I was on the other side of South Carolina. All right, I mean, still, we got really good points for that. I just wish we got a little closer. I particularly blame you, Alex. <laughs> All right, let's see where we can go from here now. Um... Oh, there's a sign right there. So let's go this way and then we'll turn around. Nope, just a miles per hour sign. Nothing too fancy there. Okay, what's this? Wait, okay, wait, which state route is this? Is it something I've heard of maybe? I don't know. I didn't want to go that way. I meant to go this way a little more. Okay, route 166. Lawrence. Lawrence County maybe? Lawrence County sounds familiar. I don't I don't know exactly what state Lawrence County's in though. I've heard of Lawrence though. I've totally heard of Lawrence. And it's Route 166. So we got 166 in Lawrence. Wait, 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 wait. What was that? What was that? You can't hide from me. What's on this sign here? Smithville and Strawberry. Oh my gosh, it's going to be anywhere. I'm going to go with South, though, somewhere. Wait. The Trail of Tears. Okay, so we are definitely in the South somewhere. I'm, I'm going to specifically go probably with around the Mississippi area. Wow, very close, actually. Not bad at all. Not bad, all right. This is, I think this is a pretty good score to be honest with you. This is like a very good score. 
Also, let me know if you guys think I should do this with friends or not in the future. It'd be really fun to, like, kind of challenge with my friends and see who could do better. You know what I mean? Who can get the better score? So, just let me know. Oh, we passed the sign. Not that I think it matters, but let's go back and read it anyway. Might say something important. Left lane, merge left. Definitely Alaska. No, I'm just kidding. All right, here we go. What do the numbers say, Mason? Adopt a highway. Okay, we got a 254 area code. Once again, an area code that I do not remember. What's the sign say? First Baptist Church. Ah, oh, we can't pull an address or anything off of it. But I'm think I'm thinking the south again for this one. I am thinking the south. Okay, down the road. 70 miles an hour. So I know where I grew up. I don't think there's a 70 mile an hour. 75. I think 75 is. I could be wrong. I could be very wrong here, and I'm sorry if I am, but I think 75 is exclusive to Texas. Oh my god! I totally just drilled that! I totally just drilled that! That was awesome! Now I'm gonna look this up real quick. 75 mile per hour speed limit. I wanna see if that's true that it is only in Texas. I don't know for sure, but swimmers in the United States. 70 on most interstate highways. 75. Apparently, no, never mind, I'm completely wrong. That was pure luck then, because apparently it seems like quite a bit of the U.S. believes in the 75 speed limit. So that was just pure luck. See, where I was from, 65 is the limit. That's in Jersey. And I've seen 70 in Florida. 75, though, I always just thought was Texas. But that works too. All right, last one, last one. Let's stick it clean. Now this. It's a suburban anywhere but with those white cat mountains i might just go for a big guess here like a big one and just throw denver with no other knowledge except for those snow-capped mountains it's kind of a dangerous guess okay we literally just hit the end of the line that way so let's go this way it's kind of a dangerous guess to just right out the gate say denver but I really think it might be Denver. Wait, wait, there was a for sale sign back there. And those usually have phone numbers on them. 801, maybe? Kind of, it's kind of got a little distorted there. 801. I don't know 801. Oh, okay. What does this say? Cottage Glen. No. Doesn't help me either. No real telltale signs just yet. But I still want to stick with Denver. And based on that snow cap thing, they're very proud of their mountain, which still makes me think Denver. Can I go? Oh, I can't go in there. Are you serious? And 2L City. Let me just see if there's a place near uh, Denver, Colorado called 2L. Or near any of these mountains here, for that matter. Okay, let's see. Okay, so no evidence there telling me that this is Denver then anymore. I kind of, the only reason I was so set on that was just the mountain was all. Saggers, what's that? Where'd the Saggers sign go? Okay, there's 801 again. <laughs> this sign disappears. That's so funny. For state representative. For what state, though? In House District 21. But where is House District 21? Oh. Dang, that was like my best, like, hint I could have received there. Ah. Oh. And it just came up a little short, to be honest. That was like so close to being a good hint. Hey, still nothing. I think I'm gonna give it like a couple more clicks and then I'm just gonna have to give an answer. And I'm gonna go somewhere in the Midwest near the mountains. All right, well, I'm gonna pick somewhere random around here and uh, really hope I nail it down. So let's go uh, somewhere around there, make the guess. Was I, 
Okay, it was near Salt Lake City. Decently close, but let's see. View summary. Does it compare you to how you do to other people? Okay. Uh, game finished. Well done. 16,000 points. That's not too bad. All right, I'm going to try a new map. I'm going to try and do a world map. All right, here we go. We're doing the world. Wish me luck, everyone. This is, uh, this is it. This is all we got. Oh, my gosh. Well, this is where we're starting. For the world one. In the middle of... Uh, Baron Road. Heinz Road. Heinz Road. Okay, so it's most likely English speaking, unless another country has RD as an abbreviation for road. So we have that much at least. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. What's that sign say? No, that is not. Oh, wait, next P. And it's 10 kilometers, so it's not America either. Okay, so we have not America, English speaking. Um, which could be any number of places from Australia to Britain to even Ireland. Millbridge, welcome in Eat Eaton Recreation Center. There, in that car. I don't know why I just that reminds me so much of Ireland when I was there. It's either the UK or Ireland. I'm gonna go with the UK. I'm gonna definitely go with the UK here. But Eaton though, now not that much I don't know. I don't know exactly where Eaton. Is. We'll go for the middle of there then. Not even close. Wow, Australia, three points. That that was pretty pretty damn embarrassing. That was uh, that was something there. All right, all right. Let's keep going up the road here. Beautiful, extremely beautiful. Oh, okay, that doesn't really help me too much. Oh, here we go. Hackus and Harwood Dale. Okay, so we know that they use the English alphabet. We know they use the English alphabet, and that's about all we know. And since Suffield, I really am feeling Britain again. But that'd be so embarrassing if I said Britain again, and I was not even close. One and a quarter miles. No. No, this place uses miles. Yeah, but it does not look like the U.S. of A. Okay, what place is English speaking? And uses miles. Canada uses kilometers. Yeah, I don't know what to say about this one. Hmm. I guess. Well, I guess the camera glitched up on that photo. And that photo. If I had to guess. That says miles, though. You know, I'm going to go with something crazy like New Zealand. I just roll with that. The UK. I love how I said I think it's the UK, and then they give me miles and throw me off completely. Great. This isn't even a loca- Okay, this is literally inside of a motorcycle shop. The Are you serious? Are you- What? This isn't a road. This isn't even a road. I'm trapped inside of a house. Pull, we understand your world. They accept everything. I've never heard of RU pay. So it's English. Never heard of RU pay. So I don't know what that is. This is literally it. This is literally it right here. I can't even get out of here. I don't think there's any way. Are you serious? You know what? Let's just go with the UK again. Not even close. We are doing so poorly right now. This is this is incredible. This is incredible how bad we're doing. Uh, well, it's in the good U.S. of A. I can tell by the flag. So that's good. Yeah, I feel like it's in the south in the U.S.A. Wait, wait. What's that? Is that a uh, Marine Corps flag or an Army flag maybe? This doesn't really help us, though. 
It's gotta be a city, or I mean a state flag, really, to help us out. What's that say? Could it be Galveston again? Could it really? Let's just give it a try. Is that really didn't... Oh, not even close. All right, well, some points are some points. Let's go this way. And we have Woostershoop and Marakwang. Uh, oh, yeah, totally. Probably going with Russia at this point. Ah, <laughs> oh, the sign's too blurry to even read. All right, we'll go down the street a little more and see what we can find, but no promises. All right, I'm going to go off of my Eastern European gambit. I'm going to go with Ukraine. South Africa. Well, after a whopping 2,600 points, which I think is probably the worst this world has ever seen. <laughs> Just look at that web and how far away I was. I think it's time I retire from this game. So, if you guys want to see me play it again, smash that like button and let me know. But apart from that, take care, everybody. Thanks for joining us. Have an awesome one.